Welcome to episode 31 of my progress series. I have decided that this episode is going to be insane. This episode is going to be focused on getting ready for raids. That means I'm going to have to get the Kibos, Kib Corin and Kibos hard diaries done. So I'm going to get easy, medium, and hard done. I'm going to focus on trying to get a blowpipe. And I need a blowpipe to start the Dragon Warhammer grind. Once I have a blowpipe and a Dragon Warhammer, and I think 78 Herblore, I'll be able to start raids. That is the goal for this video. Now, will I get a blowpipe? Will I get a Dragon Warhammer? We'll have to see. But the focus is to try to get ready for raids. Wish me luck. So for me to get the Kibos and Corrin Diaries done, I have to... I have to at least start Queen of Thieves quest, but I'm going to finish it. So I'm going to do that. I also have to complete the Depths of Despair, the Queen of Thieves, the Tale of Righteous, the Forsaken Tower, and the Ascent of Arceus. So the Queen of Thieves is... So I'm going to knock one of those out when I do Queen of Thieves. So the Depths of Despair, Tale of Righteous, the Forsaken Tower, and the, Ace, the Ascent of Arceus. Arceus. I'm getting caught up with my words here. Um, so to do the hards... I'll, I'll have the Forsaken Tower done. Architectural Alliance, I'll have to do that. And then the Piscorelius Favor, that's going to be easy. So really, I just have to get some quests done. And uh, let's get started. Okay, so I guess I haven't even done Client of Corrend, and I don't have 20% Piscorelius Favor. So that's the first step on this annoying journey. Okay, my OBS got totally messed up. Um, I, I don't even know what all you guys see right now, but I just want to let you guys know Dragon Slayer 2 has been completed. So with Dragon Slayer 2 done, I have the mythical cape. Is it called mythical? Yeah, mythical cape. It's a nice teleport next to a bank. Um, I have the video of killing Vorkath and I'll put that in there as well and still doing the quests for the Kibos Hard Diaries. Um, and some downtime in between, just trying to get some trawler gear and whatnot. Also got an, uh, let's see, what's it called? The Volcanic Shard. Did my first volcano, got a Volcanic Shard at KC7. Um, don't want you guys to see my pin, so give me just a second. Here's the Volcanic Shard. Look at that. Volcano shard, I'm sorry. But I don't have a dragon axe, so eventually I'm gonna have to go to the wilderness and boss and try to get a dragon axe. But what a freaking drop on KC7. I think I have a screenshot of that and I'll throw it in there as well. Man, I can't believe how far I'm getting. 103 mil bank, it may be a little more than that, but this tab right here especially is starting to look really beefy. <laughs> Alright, see you guys in the next clip. I meant to say dragon pickaxe, but you get the gist.
Uh, sorry if the screen is stretched right now. I'm not sure if it is, but do you guys notice anything different about the bank? Well, I'm gonna tell you anyways. Look at this trident of the swamp at like 79 KC. I will throw up the screenshots guys. It has been nuts here. Um, I need the blowpipe to start the dragon warhammer grind. Um, and then I'll also probably be doing a lot of barrows because I like more. Uh, I need arums and carils and uh, other gear for better Zora kills, so it's all going to tie together, as well as questing to get a quest cape and just knocking out that quest for the Kibos Hard Diaries. It's all going to tie together, guys. This episode is preparing us for the Dragon Warhammer grind and for Chambers of Zarek. It's going to be insane. I mean, look at this. <laughs> you guys are about to see the screenshot. Wanted to let you guys know that I have completed the Kandarin Hard Diaries. I didn't have to do any quests for that. Um, just thought, because it gives a... I f totally blanked, but it gives a boost. I believe it... Oh, no, I'm sorry. It's like a 10% boost on enchantment bolts. So I've been doing that for Vorkath. Haven't got the Vorkath head yet. But wanted to update you guys with that. I'm about to go do a farm run and then back to the Kibos hard diaries and I have to do a few more quests for that so I'll let you know when something cool happens also I believe I am at 1810 total level okay think I'm going to complete a quest depths of despair there it is one quest point 4,000 coins 1500 agility XP a favor certificate and a memoir page I can put that certificate towards any of the favors so probably going to do Lova Kenj, because why not? Psych, just kidding. It only puts 10% favor to the Hosidious. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Already have 100%. Okay, I think this is quest complete. Skip through dialogue, skip through dialogue. There we go. One more quest point 8,000 coins, a favor certificate, and a memoir page. I'm at 253 quest points. Let's see. Oh, need anything else, citizen? I don't know. Um, we get 10% favor in Shazian. Uh, yes, read it. Now I'm at 60.8%. I was at 50.8. 
So a nice free 10%. And I'll update you guys with the next quest. And just one step closer to starting the Kibos Diaries. Your boy Sway just got 73 mining from freaking mining sulfur trying to get the 20% Lovakinj favor. Yeah, yeah. Your boy Sway is lagging out for the 18th time in the last 24 hours. And I cannot stand my internet. I'm in the middle of this uh, quest. And thank you to Slayer Music's Guide. <laughs> I just completed a hard task in the Corin Diaries for smelting an ir or adamant bar here. So that's one more task out of the way and about to be one more quest out of the way. And I believe that's going to be quest complete. Skip through the dialogue. Hopefully reward. There we go. One quest point, 6k coins. Woohoo! 500 mining and smithing XP. A favor certificate. And that's going to get me to 30%. So that's 10% just from one quest. Freaking nice. And another memoir page. The human is still here. <laughs> okay. I'll see you guys in a bit. So I just have to talk to this guy. And I think this is the last quest I need to do to get all the diaries done in the Kibos and Korind hard diaries. Let's see. Woohoo, one more quest point. 2K coins, 1500 Hunter XP, 500 Runecraft, a favor certificate, which I already have 100 in the Arceus, but that's okay, that's okay. I need to go kill Shazy and the uh, Lizardmen to get some more teleports for my uh, with the Tesler Talisman, I need to go get more teleports for that, and I'm probably gonna go straight for 100% Lovakin, and get my heart I too was blind, until I stepped outside and opened up that door. I see the hesitation to make a choice that's wrong. But give in to all temptation, and all those fears are gone. Your wild side be free tonight We're limitless Let your demons dance They will be just fine I see the hesitation To make a choice that's wrong But give in to all temptation And all the fears are gone Light up the sky
I'm not sure how long this is gonna take, but after like a training montage of <laughs> running around and completing diaries, I still have to finish the heart. I think I have two more tasks. One of them is to teleport to the heart of Corind. I believe it's the heart or honor or something. One of those I have to teleport to. The next is to kill a lizardman, shaman, shaman, whatever they're called. And then I will have the Kibos hard done. So I'll update you guys when that is done. Well, the time has come and I have completed all the hard diaries. Killed some shamans, got 11 fangs, a rune chain body, an earth staff, and some coal. I've completed all the blah blah blah. Let's get the reward and I will have Kibos and Korind hard diaries completed. And we're gonna rub the antique lamp, get some XP and herb lore. 15k. I almost went from 77 to 78 with I think just the rewards. So that's really really cool. Um, and Radha's Blessing 3. There we go guys, I have Kibos hard done. And next video is going to be working towards blowpipe and um, just more progress. Thanks for watching guys, see you in the next video.